morning, I'm Connor. Here's an example for you guys. For if I go to your property and I'm taking a look around and you have an existing drain line and I see some indicators of that drain line that tell me maybe how it was styled, how it was designed and set up and installed. And I tell you that it probably just needs to be pulled out and replaced. It's not because I'm you know, trying to lie to you just so we get business. It's because we have a lot of experience of pulling these drain lines out. And everybody, I mean, a lot of homeowners are aware of it nowadays. I'll show you, I'll turn the camera. Right. This is like the common culprit, is the single wall corrugated uh, drain pipe that's perforated. So it's got holes in it. And you can see this one was, you know, directly in contact with tree roots and in the ground. And clearly, you know, not set up well initially. And so it couldn't really hold up to tree roots or you know, ground pressure in general, because the stuff's just so thin and can easily crush it with my hand like that. Sometimes this actually gets smashed after backfill, like when contractors are backfilling it, it'll just smash it, smush it like that. But generally, if I open up a catch basin and I see that it's this coming out of the outlet, I'm not too happy initially. That's not to say every corrugated line is compromised, but more often than not, it's going to be, especially if we can identify that it's perforated like that and in, co in contact with the ground. Because we know nine times out of 10, <laughs> couldn't even say 10 times out of 10, really, you're gonna have root intrusion like this. These little hair roots can get in here, they seek the water out and they'll fill the pipe up. So this one obviously, you know, was on its way. My name's Connor. Our number is 936-827-6017. If anybody needs a drainage inspection or estimate for a drainage solution, thanks.